Welcome to Heroes and Generals Beta Video Log 2. The game is currently in a beta state, so please bear in mind that the graphics and sound shown here is not final and will improve over time. In this video, I'll show you some of the features of the newest Heroes and Generals build, codenamed Bradley, which you will have access to if you have acquired a beta key. There's been a lot of community requests to tweak the LMGs as they felt overpowered. We've listened to this and many other requests, but instead of reducing rate of fire and damage for the LMGs, you can no longer run and shoot with them. The LMG tweak is part of the ongoing process of tweaking and balancing all the weapons and weapon modifications, and this is done in close collaboration with the community. So thanks to all who gives us feedback and contributes to the discussions in the forum. We are trying out a new layout of the town map, where we opened up two more crossings of the river. One is a pontoon bridge, and the other is a fort. We did this because quite often the action was centered around certain points of the catcher route, instead of around the central objectives. A new player now starts up with the Rifleman character. But you can buy additional characters and equipment using the credits you earn while playing the game. Each character can be equipped with a primary weapon, a sidearm, a close combat weapon and an extra weapon, typically mines or grenades. Your characters can also wear one or two combat badges which are achieved by playing the game and gives a small benefit when worn. You can apply five different kinds of field modifications for each weapon. Triggers, internals, sights, barrels and ammunition. Each modification modifies one of the characteristics of the weapon. Rate of fire, recoil, damage, range and precision. All of the weapon modifications are balanced. So, if you equip for instance the Lightning Bolt, then it will give your weapon a higher precision, but the trade-off is that the rate of fire will be reduced. Likewise, will Burgit Lay ammunition increase damage, but at the cost of a higher recoil. That's all for now. Remember that you can support the development of Heroes and Generals by buying War Bonds. So sign up for a beta key at heroesandgenerals.com and help us make the game you want to play.